Hello, my name is Matthew Rupp with Matthew Rupp Consulting. We help local service businesses come up higher on Google. Uh, I'm going to make a short video talking about how you can do that yourself without spending any money uh, very quickly and very easily. Google provides a platform called Google My Business. This allows you to create a profile for your business, add photos, really just, I mean, it, there's, a, there's a ton to it. We're going to kind of unpack that in just the next few minutes give you an idea how important this is to claim your profile and make it as full as rich and possible and r really show you how you can turn this into more traffic, ultimately more phone calls and, and customers for your business. What we do, I've done spreadsheets similar to this where we compare, for example, this case study compares all the plumbers in Wichita and in dozens of areas. The first thing we look at when we're working with a new client is their Google My Business profile. Is it complete and verified? If the profile is not even claimed or verified, like that just lets you know that they're they're not even really trying. No one's ever really, um, you know, tried to tr probably done anything from an online marketing perspective for this business. Is the category correct? It's it's interesting to me. It, it's sad, but it's very common that you'll see um, the category is incorrect when you look at a lot of HVAC companies or plumbers or electricians. Some will be way off. This is an AC contractor. This is just a contractor, period. Um, and then how many photos do they have <clears throat> in different and important areas? The exterior of their business, the interior. These are red because they're all so low. So just put it in perspective. Like this is the first thing we work on when we're helping a client rank better on Google is their Google and Business profile. And when you look at, this is very common how big of an opportunity this is. You have companies that haven't claimed their profile, that have the wrong category, that have incomplete information, that don't even have their business hours in here, and only three have more than 10 photos when this should be 40 or 50. So it's my point with this is it's very commonly uh, some very, very low hanging fruit that if you claim your profile and make it really complete, it can make a huge impact in your business. So let's jump right in. The <clears throat> this is the inside of your Google My Business profile. When you log in, you can you want to make sure that all the inf the details about your business are correct. Uh, of course, they want to make it easy for you to advertise, which you don't have to do. A post is a new thing. This is where you can add a, a timely post about your business. You know a. Uh, sports bar has a happy hour or a restaurant has free cupcakes on Friday kind of thing. Their messaging, this is a new feature. This is where you can have customers message you right from that first page of Google and have it show up on your phone like a text message. There's a section for insights. This tells you how many people came to your business, uh, how many phone calls you got, how many people clicked to your website, and I'll touch on these different sections here in a moment, but I just wanted to review them. Uh, reviews are important. How many are unresponded? How many have been responded to? What's your stars on Google? Your Google Analytics, how much traffic you're getting, where your traffic's coming from, how long you're staying on your site, what pages you're looking at. This is all in here, which is a wealth of information, and this is all free. Your ch YouTube channels, how many subscribers you've had, how many views, how many people have watched your videos. And this is one of the biggest opportunities that you have for your business when it comes to, comes to taking control of your online marketing is your Google My Business profile and then being able to add this to your phone, making it super easy, like right on the fly. It could be <clears throat> taking a picture of a, of a out in the field of a job really well done or a letter from a customer thanking you for a great job. Uh, an example of someone in your office, you could shoot a... Uh, a quick video of somebody working on something or fixing something or how they take care of an issue, how you, what kind of, what your core values are as a company or pictures in your business. I mean, it's so easy to capture things like that in the moment on your phone uh, and go and be able to upload that straight to your Google profile for your business. So if you haven't, I encourage you to claim your Google business profile. It, it's full of, full of ways that you can see what's going on and really let Google and the world know who you are, what you're doing, uh, what you, who you serve. I want to touch on one important item before I wrap up. 
and that's photos. Photos is, is such a huge opportunity. Google really wants your photos, and they come right out and say, like, you can add photos about your business, 15, 20 photos in all these areas, interior, exterior, about your product or service, uh, your team, your logo, a 360 view of your business. And Google come right out, comes right out and says, <clears throat> four different times they stress the importance of photos and how that can result in more click. Businesses with recent photos typically receive more clicks to their website. Post photos. Um, customer actions, driving directions, phone calls, photo views. The number of times your photos have been viewed compared to businesses like yours. Your photos receive 200% more views than similar businesses. Post more to stay ahead. Photo quantity, uh, you, businesses like you. So they're, they're coming right out and say it over and over that you're going to get more clicks, you're going to get more traffic if you have photos. Photos are super important to Google and they're really rewarding companies that will really make it add a, a really rich profile of the about their business when it comes to photos. So I, I encourage you to, to really to claim your Google business profile and to really make it as rich and full as possible. If you, if you run into any roadblocks, you're welcome to reach out and I'm happy to answer any questions. And I hope this was helpful. Have a great day.